going on guys i'm at the shop got my car inside i already got it on jack stands and stuff i'm about to uh fix my right fog light again like it keeps it keeps turning off for some reason water water keeps getting into the lines or something and i just gotta dry it out and tape it up again or something i don't know i gotta do something with it i'm about to do my inner fender wells and probably my abs wire so yeah i'm gonna show you guys what i got going on let's go So yeah, this is what I'm doing. Got it on. Got to take out the other tire. Yes, sir. So I'm getting my new ABS wire in right now. Hopefully, it takes out all my VSA light, my ABS light, and maybe my brake light, unless I got something wrong with my e-brake like the cable stretched or something because that's on too so yeah hopefully i get rid of that i'm gonna be putting on my fender wells and i still have to check this side of the fog light because i don't know what's going on it just keeps shutting off on me so i just need to tape up like the connections or something so yeah that's that's what i'm doing right now it's going pretty smoothly so i got my bumper all off i'm gonna check all the connections and dry it up then and turn it on, see if it turns on. I'm on electrical tape, everything up, and make sure like no water keeps getting in the damn lines. This is like the third or fourth time I'm doing it, so that's that's pretty annoying. So, so I got one in so far. The only thing I don't like is this part. It's all sloppy looking and stuff, but you know that's what you get when you buy eBay stuff. But this was like 40, 50 bucks for a pair, so. I'm not spending a hundred and sign bucks for one side. That's a oh, yeah, fuck that. So yeah, time to go do the other side. Then put on my bumper, then put these on. And yeah, I'm all set. So I got this side up pretty smoothly. But this side, if you guys watch my other videos and whatnot, you knew that this wheel popped out and all the tabs underneath here rolled. So I had to, you know, pry it out a little bit so I could get the tabs on for the fender wells. So, do little jobs, and they're always a little extra. That's how it is every single time. But I should be done soon. And it'll be brand new. So, so I pretty much got it good-ish. You can see that it's kind of bent out before there was like it's pressed up against the fender so you couldn't even do nothing with it so for the most part i got it you know but i'm gonna have to be repairing this fender anyway and repainting it and like yeah you can see <laughs> this my wheel popped out on this side then on the other side i need to do body work so this year i'm fixing the thing up getting it clean whatever i need to get painted painted but as you see, you know, the spoiler yesterday was all messed up, cracked on either ends and shit, supposedly because of shipping. And he insured the cargo, so I'm gonna contact them tomorrow because they're not open on Sundays and see if I could get all my money back or whatever because that thing is fucked up. Like, I can't do anything with it. Well, I could get it repaired, but. That shit's fucked up. Like, I didn't pay 400 bucks for it, so... For that. Like, <laughs> that's ridiculous. So, yeah. You know, I'm gonna figure that shit out. So, I got this side all up. Uh, I had a zip tie right here. I ran out of tabs, and... This isn't looking the greatest. Because it's still bent a bit. But I got the front bumper on. Just gotta go underneath. Put the wheels on. And I'm good to go. Bust it, bust it, bust it down, bust it, bust it.